Okay, two big problems. The case against him is very strong. And probably more important, the legal conviction isn't the only conviction that we got to reverse. The more dangerous conviction is the absolute certainty of the American people that Klaus is guilty. Finding grounds for reversal won't be enough here. Judges on the Rhode Island Supreme Court will have to go home to their spouses and explain why they reversed. Get them to do that. We have to completely obliterate every single aspect of the state's case destroy both the medical case and their witnesses so the judges have no possible way to affirm. Total victory or we are dead in the water. Now, I assume that you've all had a, uh, an opportunity to look at the transcripts, first impressions. Yeah, me. I think this whole thing stinks. I think Klaus von Bülow stinks. He's obviously guilty of something pretty despicable. And if we free him, we become partners in his crime, accessories after the fact. I'm really shocked with your record defending the poor and oppressed that you've taken this case. I won't have anything to do with it. And I hope my fellow students won't either. Goodbye. May I exercise my First Amendment right to free speech? If lawyers only defended innocent clients, there'd be 10 defense lawyers in the entire country, and none of you would be able to find a job. Why help guilty people get off? Oh, you're sure he's guilty, 100% sure. He had a lawyer. He had a trial. He was convicted. Are you sure he had a fair trial? Come on. It's the basis of the whole legal system. Everyone gets a defense.